Chanel and today I'm here with a DIY sewing giraffe. Here. There are many sets. There. But I chose giraffe for this one. Now, so they have all the materials for us. We don't need to prepare any materials. But the very good thing is if you're a starter for sewing, they give us a plastic needle. Yay! So we'll, so it won't per poke us. <laughs> so they have a giraffe body fabric here. The giraffe is yellow. And this is the giraffe's mouth, the orange one. And they have buttons. This one is for the, um, let me see. Oh, it's for the, like, the, his dress because it's long. And this one is for his eyes. Hello. And so they also have, um, yeah, this instruction. Let's see inside. There. So these are all the materials they give us. They're showing the materials. And this one is where we end the finished product. So this is for basic, for starters who start to sew. So this, first we take out the fabric, the string, you see, had to tie it on one end, you see that? And then we take the other end, we twirl it like that, pew, pew, pew. And then we try to get it in the needle, this side of the needle. Okay, how to get everything in. And if it doesn't work, you put your slide bar on it. So it will like, your slide bar is like glue. Nothing! Okay, and then we try to poke it in. With the side has holes. Ooh, this is a bit hard. We try to make it as thin as possible. And then we put the needle right. It's a bit hard, so you can ask your parents to help. There we go. See? We got it. So when we already put the string in the needle, next we have to make the string equal. See, it's already equal. And next we'll start sewing. So we have to make equal. And then next we put the needle down first and we see, this is the mouth, right? Is it this side, this side or this side? So it's this side, right? So we start sewing on this side. So there we take the needle, we poke it on the back so we will not see where it like seal because it will not be nice. So you put it in, feel, and then you see this hole is for the nose too, this one. Then we pull it up, feel, and then we take it down. We take the full one up, and then we can we continue with the mount. Go up, up, and then go down. You continue doing this. And then go up. So when you do this, you have to make sure that the needle goes to the end. Okay. Pull it up. Loop. Like that. Then we go down. So 
see it's connected to each other. Then we go up again. In a pattern. Up and down. And then we're finished with the mouth. So when we're finished with the mouth, we continue with the other note, nose. We don't need to cut it. We go up. And then we go down. There we go. We're finished with the nosies. <laughs> so next we have to cut this. Okay, so we have to get a scissor. Okay, I got the scissors. But before that, we have to make a knot at where we end. See? So this is where we end. So we make a knot here. Okay. And then, after that, we cut it. We cut very closely. There. Right over there. Oh. Here we go. Like that. So then we're finished here. See? Mop, 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 mop. So let's go next to number two. We'll finally make the face. Yay! Okay, so we take the body. Then we take this, which is like, you see the giraffe, it has like stripes of brown. Okay, so next we're gonna do the eye. Um, so I'm gonna make it easy because last we were using the black one, the black one, right? So now we continue with the black. So we take it out first. But one technique I told you first that we have to sew from the back. So we will hide the mistakes. Like it's not mistakes, but then it will not be beautiful. Because when we end, we have to put cotton inside, sew it up. So, let's start. So, you have to put, you have to start with one first and make sure that you put it on the right side because if you put it on the wrong side, it'll be like, the color is not gonna be nice and the texture is different. The texture of the right one will be soft and fluffy, but the wrong one will be like rough and hard. So, we go with, one eye make it the same length and place at as where the dot is see now we see the holes so we start we go from the back the up one feel You can see. And then we go back. You have to put it in different holes. And we go in. And there we go. We see. Oops. Okay, so sometimes the knot can be too small. So don't make it too tight. Okay, we got a new knot. There we go. It's already a bit big. So, then we start again. Put it at the same place. We start from the bottom. We go up. We go down. There. Make sure that it is still so it won't flip anywhere there we go 
here. It won't flip anywhere. It's still. Now, you don't need to cut the string as I told you at the first one. So we take the other eye and then we put it right away. There we go. So we don't need to cut the black wire because we, like, the eye is the last of black wire. So we'll not be wasting anything. Let me put it down. And there we go. We're done with two eyes. Hello, my name is Giraffe. I don't have any mouth. <laughs> so then you can see on the back, then the next, we make a knot. Put our finger in the circle. Make sure it goes down so our eye will be like tight and it won't go out easily. There we go. We got the eye. Great job, myself. <laughs> so next, we'll see what to do. So we have to change the wire because we're doing a brown one. This one. Okay, so, so the technique is the same, right? So you make the knot at the end, and you put it at the same slant, like that, and so you go, you see, remember I told you this technique, that you have to go from the back, so you see this, is this beautiful? No, right? We will hide it with the other one on top, and we put cotton inside. So every technique and everything's the same, you just have to choose new new stuff like that that we put it down see like that make sure it's in the same holes like that then this one we can put it let's see for them where did they put it they put, it over. They put this one over here Okay, so you can start sewing. We start from the back like always. So I will go sew mine, you go sew yours, and see you later. So when we finish the brown dot, we um we take the mouthy and then we stick it on my giraffe. Make sure the holes are same, and then we start sewing again. Let's go. Make sure you hold the orange thing, so it won't like go. It won't slide, or else it will not be beautiful. Make sure it's tight. We already did all, like almost all. We put the cotton in, so they give us cotton. So we had to put it in tightly, or else the hand will be like very, like zombie. It, our giraffe will look like zombie. So we had to put it in tightly. Ugh. Make sure every section is full. Ugh. Okay. So, af so, after we're done with the cotton, see? We are going to make the ears. So, we're using two fa fabric for the ear, because it has an inner ear and an outer ear. So, we put the holes at the same place. Double tape. So, when we're done with the downy part, we go up. There we go. We got our ear done and the little pointy thing. And next we're going to do the other side of it. So we keep on doing it until we reach the other side. You want to see my finished product, guys? Let's see. What? Not this. Me. Her name is Gigi. 
It looks similar, but not really safe. See? Is it nice? So, don't forget to comment down below if you like Gigi. If it's like the same. Okay, so don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment down below. But, don't forget to ring the